Tender Router fans, this is Paul, one of the techs for Micro Center, and today we're going to take another look at the Tender AC1750 dual band router. Today we're going to take a look at the basic setup of the router. Let's get started. Okay, so you may have noticed the pattern with these routers. Uh, routers are typically very easy to set up. It's basically the same for any router. First thing you want to do is go ahead and take the AC, plug it into the power jack. So the next step is to take the Ethernet cable that is currently running from your modem to your computer, take it out of your computer, and then plug it in the back of your router into the blue port. It's the one port that's going to be a different color, signifying that it's a different signal going in. And the blue means it's the signal from the modem. The yellow ports go out to your computer or other device. So that's what we would do now. We're going to go ahead and it doesn't matter which one, there's four typically. Uh, using one or four doesn't matter there's no order so then you take the other end of the cable that you just put in one of the numbered ports and you put the other end in your computer like so the next steps take place on the computer so let's move into the computer so once the hardware is set up you want to go ahead and open up a browser go to 192.168.0.1 that's the IP address of your tender router unless you've changed it and this is the initial setup so you wouldn't have changed it uh, the username and password the default username and password is lowercase admin for the username and lowercase admin as the password so go ahead and type those in and then click on login uh, for most of you out there, the, you want to check DHCP. That is how you get your IP address from your from your ISP. That means your IP address is dynamic, which means it's, it changes all the time. So just make sure DHCP is selected, and then click OK. Okay, so this is first going to take you to, uh, it's going to show you your network settings. So you want to hit Refresh. Once you hit Refresh, uh, it should pull in an IP address from your ISP, and then you will be able to get on the, the Internet. All right, there you go. If we were to open a browser right now, it, it, it would work. It would pull us on the Internet. We would be able to pull up any websites that we need to go to. All right, so that's how to uh, set up your Tenda AC1750 dual band router. If you have any other questions, come visit us at www.microcentertech.com or visit our no-wait chat service at chat.microcentertech.com.